Right now, the trial of a Miami Beach police officer turned suspect is beginning. He and others were arrested in the summer of 2021 after prosecutors say they beat a man in handcuffs. Local Tennessee Leanne Morty Hong joins us live from Miami with the latest from court. Leanne. And this officer is facing felony battery charges. According to the state, this officer had no business kicking the, the victim, the alleged victim, while he was down and later slamming his head against the ground. His defense attorney says that was no slam at all and that it was the victim who was escalating this encounter moment by moment. A jury of four men and four women, including two alternates, listened to opening statements today in the trial of Kevin Perez. Listen and look at the, the videos or pictures that you were shown and base your decision on the evidence. Delonta Crudup escalated the confrontation with police. The Miami Beach police officer, who remains suspended without pay, is charged with third-degree felony battery, stemming from this incident back in July 2021. This case, sponsored by the state attorney's office, flips justice on its head. Bad is good, and good is bad. Crudup is getting the benefits, and the good police officer is getting prosecuted. Prosecutors say the alleged victim, Delante Crudup, fled from police on a scooter, then ran into the Royal Palm Hotel. Video shows Perez kicking Crudup in the head and slamming his head on the ground. There's going to be video showing him kicking at Mr. Crudup's head. There's going to be more video showing that he picked Mr. Crudup up while he was already cuffed and dropped him on his face. Mr. Crudup is going to tell you that he was not bleeding up until the time he was dropped on his face. Jurors heard from Crudup himself describing the night in question. Were you arrested in Miami Beach on July 26, 2021? Yes, sir. Were you charged? Yes, sir. Is that case still pending in Miami-Dade County? Yes, sir. And that was just the very beginning of Crudup's testimony. He is still on the stand Right now, we should tell you that jurors did not begin to hear those opening statements until about 2.30 this afternoon. That is because ever since this morning, there were concerns raised uh, about Crudup's testimony. That is, that there were concerns he could potentially incriminate himself during that testimony uh, in regards to two cases that he is facing out of this jurisdiction. He is uh, ha has been granted use immunity as far as the case he's facing here in Miami-Dade County that's related to this whole situation from 2021. So anything he says in this trial about that uh, can't be used against him. But the other two cases is fair game. Ultimately, though, he did decide to move forward with testifying without pleading the fifth. For now, reporting live here in Miami, Leanne Morejon, Local 10 News. Lots of moving parts there. Okay, thanks so much, Leanne.